so let's go for the configuration now the modem is power up so uh, we need to log into that so how to find this router default IP so I think my uh, previous videos I already explained uh, how to get this uh, IP address of the device okay just go to start button type CMD and enter type IP config so you can find out here 192 this part 192.168.1.100 now the DHCP is enabled inside the router so no need to internet for this configuration just I am configured without internet I just showing on uh, configuration part okay so what is the router IP now so this is the default gateway whatever you are using this any uh, internet so the gateway means that it will be a router IP address so let's go to this uh, con uh, to configure to open the Google browse type the IP 192.168.1.1 enter so now you can see mobile eLife router welcome to your mobile eLife e uh, e router now you want to log in so what is the password this is the default password password is come to this device user type user same down user okay this is the default password so go to login now you are already in the router okay so basic setup I am going to show you the basic things so now you want to configure the Wi-Fi okay just go to the wireless okay whatever you want to name here you can type excuse me let me open here okay so this is SSID you want to put any name you can put I think my previous video it's not clear I just uh, put the video without voice so this time I'm uh, explaining with the voice one of my subscribers asked me how to find the password of the SSID so I'm showing that here let's go here so SSID name whatever you want you can put here anything whatever you want to put okay there's most of the people now know that even I'm explaining here so before it was configured this SSID okay so now go to the security okay this SSID you create here so what kind of password you want to put this is if you want you don't want a password just make it open if you want uh, WPA2 WPA2 PSK whatever you want you can select here let me show you this old one okay so this password so what is my uh, one of the subscriber asked me I couldn't find the password when I type it so where is that I just click this one click here to display your password okay this one it's happened when you click it there is one window is open here this is your password you can see here okay now I am my voice okay I will put my voice I am saying my name my uh, channel name softtech okay channel name softtech123 so which I type the password is correct or no so just go here now you can see softtech123 so um, one of my subscriber asked me this question uh, so I think he can able to see my video so this is the screen it's open separately it will not display here so again I'm showing you when you click this one click here to display means it will display another place now you see here this is the display okay so major thing we have to do uh, when you configure uh, Wi-Fi you have to uh, make uh, sure this one you are connecting with the DHCP or manual that I think all of them know about this one DHCP 
and uh, dynamic IP and DHCP you know if the DHCP is working automatically it will IP pick up if you want to control from the router so you can able to uh, make this one DHC, uh, DHCP if you want to make it dynamic so where I, we can do that system so just go here advance okay now need this one uh, let's go to this this one okay it runs this is you know uh, 5 gigahertz and 2 gigahertz that one uh, it's depend on your request you can create uh, 2.4 gigahertz or 5 gigahertz you can do it whatever your requirement you can open both okay so SSID you can create like that no issue with the voice configuration everything you can when you uh, request from the uh, the ISP internet service provider when you request that then they will able to give a uh, access for the voice and system and future this is if you want to change your router uh, we when you log in to that router we put user user so if you want you can change it old password user and if you want whatever new password you can change it according to your uh, system the security so this is uh, you know uh, there's many options are here if anyone need any support I am here to help you this channel is special for subscribers if you need anything make uh, put your comments definitely I will make the videos and I am really apologize one of the subscriber asked me for this password display I'm very sorry it's very late uh, reply next time it won't happen again so whatever you need just put me on the comment accordingly because there is so many features are here I don't want to waste the time people I show just basic setup okay if we need uh, how to configure for the DHCP how to make this one in uh, uh, dynamic you can ask me anything from that one uh, definitely I will uh, make you comfortable uh, with one There's, there is I am here to help you if you need anything you can ask me thank you very much I hope you understand for this uh, uh, the configuration if you need more support please uh, uh, put your comments definitely I will update you mere out regular mom singing keyword here explain Kevin at the villa maker villa me Saudi will use kerana router mereka. Lanka yang mana hari router mereka use kerana mana hari bulan tu derangan tu mana command tu kita anda router mereka model number kita anda definitely I will do the configuration. In the video mande nama Saudi le itu companies macam perikai mobile e life and the fiber router use pun rana so ada orang kalau kahwin di sana itu paninan. Enam nama nak plus Sri Lanka lah biar itu so orang kalau kita ada configuration le doubt Edum tewa yang anda ada, anda model number, anda router da model number yang anda kandung, anda komen sila pula, anda angkat tayar mata anda, review panni, ada kuna anda video anda post pula. Thank you very much. Hope this video like everyone, subscribe panjang, like keranda, share it. Thank you.